the home of internet radio. Hi, welcome to Fat Beats. My name's AK Stepper, um, I'm DJ, promoter, co-owner of Fat Beats. I first started in radio through being a listener, mostly, getting to know a few people, uh, putting a few mixtapes about, going to clubs, handing them out to people, uh, leaving them in record shops. I used to do guest shows on uh, London Underground, on Unknown FM, Prime FM, which then became Extreme FM. I went on to Shine FM. Uh, I used to do like two uh, till six in the morning, uh, freezing cold, dirty little um, studio underneath a kebab shop, freezing cold, like I'd put like, a fan heater on and that. Uh, but it was good, good times. That was the proper days when Garage was fresh, like it was a fresh UK thing. Like. Hey, Jay Scotty. No, no, alright. <laughs> so you catch him in here every Monday. He's our studios, got Pioneer CDJs, Technic 1210 standard. We've got a uh, Pioneer TG um, 600. We started off early on the internet scene. And partner Flex come up with a Big idea of Fat Beats. He started getting uh, into PCs and internet, which I didn't have a clue about. Um, I brought him into the DJing scene, uh, so we sort of helped each other out. Thought, hey, how do you, uh, what do you reckon about doing an internet radio site? Flex was playing on another radio site at the time, so we see how it was working and all that. It was just something new and fresh to do and a business, we, we all wanted a business to do. I was going to start a record shop, um, but this is the way forward, we can do anything through here. We are big locally, but we're far bigger worldwide. We've, we've got, we're big in loads of communities worldwide. You can walk in with your records, not in a pizza bag or your Royal Mail bag or whichever way you used to do it. You can walk in, uh, be proud, uh, not worry about your records getting stolen. Uh, you can use your real name if you want to. Uh, you can publicise yourself on social networking sites, MySpace, uh, Facebook, without having any trouble from the DTI. It's just nice to be part of something legal and not feel like you're doing anything wrong, not like pirates are doing anything wrong. If it wasn't for the pirates, we would have no nightlife that wasn't uncommercial run by the certain commercial stations. Uh, I mean, at the end of the day, the pirates just want to um, create a local uh, scene, don't they? Like, uh, it keeps DJs off the street. It's a hobby, a passion. Uh, from the strength of that, you get uh, make a lot bit of a fan base. You can create events, do your own nights. People always want something to do. In looking at Pirate Radio, we had seen a dedicated group of people contributing to a vibrant underground music scene, often providing an alternative to mainstream offerings. We had seen fear at the prospect of digitalisation, but hope in the opportunities offered by the internet. And plus, having now been given a legal platform from which to broadcast, maybe the pirates will be accepted more readily into mainstream culture. I am for the 